It has been months since the start of the non-fungible token craze, and while it has certainly cooled down over the past weeks, there is a lot to explore when it comes to the niche. One of the most interesting use cases of NFTs since 2020 has been the combination of the DeFi and NFT to generate new investment opportunities. If you were paying attention back in the day, you might remember projects like Meme and Avigochi, which allowed users to yield farm and gamify NFTs in a whole new way. Well, these ideas were certainly interesting, but didn't prove to be that viable in the market. However, there are many ways in which DeFi and NFTs can be combined. This is especially relevant at a time when NFT marketplaces launched by the big guys are threatening to create silos that go against the principles of blockchain and crypto themselves. Today we will be talking about a new project that aims to transform NFTs into more than collectibles by creating an NFT marketplace that rewards its users using some of the principles of DeFi – NFT Mall. Are you making the money you want to in cryptos? There is a lot of money to be made in crypto, but you aren't going to get there by buying a little bit of Bitcoin and stashing it away as the early adopters did a decade ago. Trading with leverage allows you great trading ideas to soar in value and create massive profits. You should be trading with the best, and buy bit is the best, but remember guys, leverage trading is only recommended for experienced traders. You will also get a 1600 bonus on Bybit by taking only 25 seconds to register, so deposit and claim your bonus now. Have you heard? We are giving away $10,000. Yes, $10,000. Check the link in the description for your chance to win. Hello and welcome to Cryptopedia. I'm your gracious host, Crypto.org. If you love cryptocurrencies and finance, you are in the right place. Don't forget to firmly press that like button, comment, share and subscribe if you want to keep up with all our great content. Let's talk about NFT Mall, a project that is aiming to disrupt the NFT ecosystem. NFT Mall defines itself as the world's first creator-centric, DeFi-powered, multi-chain operation, physically redeemable NFT marketplace. That is quite a mouthful, but the concept is pretty simple, but also genius. Once you are done with the video, you will see that all those terms really make sense. Ok, so NFT Mall is an NFT marketplace running in Binance Smart Chain and Polygon. While most NFT marketplaces are limited to Ethereum or one of its competitors, with NFT Mall there is no need to compromise. You have access to Ethereum-based NFTs via Polygon, without having to pay the ridiculous gas fees that Ethereum can have at times, and also to the growing ecosystem that is BSC, which has been one of the most popular alternatives to Ethereum when it comes to DeFi and NFTs. This is the meaning behind multi-chain operation in the description we mentioned before. Why does the team behind the project say it is creator-centric? Well, that is an easy one. NFT Mall was built for mainstream digital artists. It is not an ecosystem where they are expecting to sell pieces valued in the millions of dollars that are the result of who knows what kind of behind-the-curtains deals. No. It is an ecosystem where all creators can share their art, receiving full price and ongoing royalties without paying any fees. Sure, we might see NFTs worth thousands and millions of dollars, but NFT Mall is meant to be a fully transparent and healthy NFT ecosystem. For collectors, this means that the copyright and quality of NFTs are protected, which allows you to buy your favorite digital pieces with confidence. If you are a fan of an artist and want to promote them, you will also be able to do so and gain affiliate commissions if the artist enables it. Basically, you help them sell their art and you gain rewards for doing so. Finally, if you are an NFT connoisseur, you can contribute to the marketplace by curating content, keeping it authentic and safe. All of these factors make NFT Mall a one-in-a-kind marketplace run and maintained by the community, which is how it should be, if you ask me. Now let's talk about one of the biggest features of NFT Mall – physically redeemable NFTs. This feature creates a bridge between the digital NFTs we all know and love and physical products that can be secured using blockchain technology. Let's say, for example, that you want to have your NFT printed in a shirt, mug or mousepad. NFT Mall gives you tools to easily customize the product with the NFT you own and have it created. While the concept is simple in itself, it is the authenticity that blockchain provides that makes this unique. While not a lot of details have been given regarding the full capabilities of this feature, I'm really interested in seeing what ideas the team will come with in the future, as one of the biggest criticisms toward NFT has been their virtual nature. Lastly, let's talk about that DeFi-powered part of the description. NFT Mall has two types of mining available to users – liquidity mining and marketplace mining. Liquidity mining means 2% of the total game supply – this is the marketplace token, which we will discuss later – is distributed as a reward to those users providing liquidity on exchanges. 
There is also marketplace mining, which basically means that all active buyers and sellers at the platform can mine 30% of the total game supply as rewards for sustaining the ecosystem. Another benefit for the game stakers is that all of them receive dividends proportional to their stakes, with 60% of the platform's fees being distributed among them. Lastly, by staking GAM, you will be able to have early access to exclusive NFT drops, which will allow you to acquire some of the most exclusive NFTs the market will offer. Let's see that definition again. Creator-centric, DeFi-powered, multi-chain operation, physically redeemable NFT marketplace. We already described all of these objectives, but we are missing some features related to the platform's token, GAM. GAM is the native token of the marketplace and it serves several purposes. First, it is used to power the decentralized governance of the marketplace, giving holders the right to vote and partake in the decision-making process. Second, the token can also be used to pay for all platform fees, which you will receive a 50% discount for if you pay them with GAM. Third, it can be staked to receive all of the benefits I mentioned earlier. Fourth, creators and holders who stake GAM will have their NFTs ranked higher by NFT Mall Smart Sorting Engine, making it easier to sell it. Fifth and last, the token can be used to bid on the weekly auction of NFT advertisement slots. These slots will be displayed on the homepage, increasing visibility exponentially. As you can see, the GAM token has several benefits and serves multiple purposes, which is a great incentive for users to acquire them, stake them and use them. As if all of these were not enough, the token is deflationary in nature, as 10% of all fees are used to buy back GAM and burn them permanently. While this is not especially unique these days, it is still a great way to ensure the value of the token tends to increase. A max supply of 20 million tokens will be minted with 20% or 4 million being destined to the pre-sale, while the remaining 80% will be used for different purposes. Noteworthy uses include 30% for marketplace mining, 5% for technical bounty and hackathon, which I will elaborate on in a moment, and 50% for marketing and educational programs. Those 5% destined to technical bounty and hackathon is really important as it is part of the bug bounty program. It will allow anyone who finds a bug or vulnerability in the protocol or smart contracts to report them, getting an exchange reward for helping improve the stability and security of the ecosystem. NFT Mall has established partnerships with major names in the blockchain industry, including Polygon, which was formerly known as Matic Network, Ferrum Network, Morales and Venly. It also has support from major investors like ICO Panther, Clever Capital, Chili Petty Capital, Chainix and many other major players. The marketplace will go live on July 29th of this year, so I would recommend you to keep an eye on future announcements. For now, the second public round B has already closed, but if you already have a quiet game, you can start talking in any of these pools – silver, gold, platinum and diamond. While this project is still in development, everything indicates that it has a solid base and could compete with the existing NFT marketplaces due to the benefits it offers all parties involved. In addition to being already audited by Certic, one of the top blockchain audition firms, the bounty hunting program is a great incentive to ensure the security of the platform. But let me know what you think. Does NFT Mall have what it takes to compete with the big guys? Is there any other NFT marketplace you think I should be keeping an eye on? Let me know in the comment section. Thanks for watching Cryptopedia. If you enjoyed the video or learned something from it, don't forget to firmly press that like button, comment, share and subscribe if you haven't done so already. This was your gracious host, CryptoOrg.